What if I told you that by the end of this guide, you'll have everything you need to create amazing animated kids stories just like this one? Hi friends, let's tell jokes! Yes, I love jokes! Why did the banana go to the doctor? Tell us why! Because it wasn't peeling well! <laughs> My turn, why did the dog sit in the shade? Why, dog? Because he didn't want to be a hot dog. <laughs> What's brown and sticky? What? A stick! <laughs> Let's play and laugh all day! <laughs> Sounds incredible, right? But why should you be interested in making these videos? Well, let me share a little secret with you. Kids' video channels are a goldmine on platforms like YouTube. This is because kids love fun, colorful, and engaging stories. Parents appreciate the educational value and the entertainment it provides. It's a win-win situation. This makes these channels a big hit. Many of them get thousands and millions of views and make a lot of money because kids watch the videos over and over again. For example, Check out this channel with 1.6 million followers. According to Social Blade, they're raking in between $4,000 to $68,000 a month. This could be you. In this video, I'll demonstrate how you can create similar animated cartoons for kids in under 10 minutes using free AI tools. The best part is that you don't need to have special skills or experience. It is very simple. So stick with me. Let's get started. Okay, let's break down the steps for creating our kids' animated story video like this. One. Creating a fun script for our kids' animation. 2. Record a suitable voiceover to narrate the story. 3. Create animated cartoon characters that fit the story. 4. Design animated backgrounds for our characters. 5. Combine all the character videos and backgrounds into one final video with captions. Keep in mind that we can do all these tasks quickly and effortlessly with the help of AI tools. Step 1. Creating the story. Start by crafting a simple yet exciting story that kids will love. Think about their favorite things like animals, adventures, and fairy tales. Write a short script that's easy to understand and full of fun. We'll use an amazing AI tool called ChatGPT to help us with this. Head over to ChatGPT and give it a prompt to create a joyful story featuring a monkey, goat, antelope, and dog using simple language suitable for kids. Keep it under 500 characters. Once it's done, you'll have a perfect story ready in just a few minutes. Now that our kid's story is set, let's move on to step two, creating the voiceover. For this step, we'll use another powerful AI tool called Eleven Labs. It's great for transforming text into natural sounding speech. You can choose different languages, genders, accents, and reading speeds. First, copy the first sentence spoken by our monkey character from the script that we generated with ChatGPT. Then head to Eleven Labs. If it's your first time, sign up or log in with your Google account. Now let's get our script and voiceover ready. To start with the voiceover, follow these simple steps. Paste your story into the box on Eleven Labs' website. Click on Menu and choose Voices, then select Library. Type Kid in the search box to find voices suitable for children's stories. Listen to the voices and pick the ones you like. Click Add to Voice Lab, edit the name if needed, and click Add Voice. Repeat this for all four characters in our story selecting a total of four voices. Go back to the menu, click on Speech, then Voice Lab, and choose one of the voices, like Benny for our monkey. Adjust Settings and click Generate. The voiceover will be ready in a few seconds. Listen to it and click Download. Repeat these steps for each character in your script. For example, for the goat, clear the text box, paste the next statement, choose a voice, like Whimsy, adjust Settings, Generate, Listen, and Download. Once all voiceovers are done, organize them in a file to keep everything neat. This process ensures each character sounds just right, making your story engaging and fun for kids to enjoy. Step 3 is to create our animated cartoon characters. To do this, we will use Adobe Express. I've attached a link to it in the description below. Just click on the link, sign up, and log in. When you land on the page, click on Animate from Audio. You'll see many characters to choose from. Since our story is about animals, click on Animals. The first animal in our story is a monkey, so select a monkey character. Next, change the background to green by clicking on Background selecting custom color and choosing green. This will make it easy to remove the background later. After this, click on size and choose YouTube since our video is for YouTube. Now that we have selected our character, the next step is to convert our still image character into a talking video. Enable this feature and then click on browse to select the voiceover you recorded with 11 labs for our monkey character's first dialogue. In a few seconds, the video will be generated. Let's play it. Hi friends, let's tell jokes. 
Looks perfect, right? Now let's generate our next video. From the script, the next dialogue to be generated is Goat's first dialogue. Go back to Adobe Express, select a goat animation, and then click on Browse to select the correct voiceover for our Goat's first dialogue. Wait for a few seconds and the video will be generated. Let's listen to it. Yes, I love jokes. Why did the banana go to the doctor? Amazing. Repeat the process for the next character. Our next character is Antelope. So select an Antelope character. Click on Browse. Select our Antelope's first voiceover. And in a few seconds, our talking video is ready. Let's play it. Tell us why. Very cool. Repeat the same for the dog character. Select a dog character and click on Browse to upload our dog's first dialogue. Just like that, the video is ready. Let's play it. My turn. Why did the dog sit in the shade? Incredible, isn't it? To get the rest of our scenes for the rest of our story, repeat the same process for each character's dialogue till the end of our story to generate all of them. Now that we have all our animated characters' dialogues, it's time to add some extra touches to make our story even better. If you look at the script, you'll see places where the characters laugh and moments of silence when one character is speaking and the others are listening. Let's start by creating the laugh scenes for each character. I've already recorded laugh voiceovers for each character using 11 labs. First, go back to Adobe Express, select one of our characters, then click on Browse and upload the laugh voiceover. In a few seconds, the video will be ready. Let's listen to it. <laughs> Isn't it cool? You can see the character's mouth moving as it laughs. Repeat this process for the rest of our characters and download each laugh video. Next, we need to create silent scenes for each character. Select a character, click on Browse, and upload a silent audio file, which has no voice or sound in it. Wait for a few seconds, and the video will be ready. Let's see it. As you can see, the character is quiet, not saying anything, but the eyes are blinking to show it's attentive. Download this silent scene and repeat the process for the rest of the characters. Now, we have all our animated characters' videos, including their dialogues, laughs, and silent moments. Make sure to arrange all of them in a neat and organized file. Step 4. Design an animated background where our characters will be placed. For this, we will use Canva. Click the link in the description to get Canva. On the home page, select Create Video. Click on Elements, and in the search box, search for a background that suits your story. For our story, let's search for Flower Meadows. You will see several options. Click Search All, then let's select this as it fits our story best. Click on the three dots above the image and set it as the background. Next, let's increase the length of our background video to 30 seconds. Next, we need to make our background lively by adding some animated elements. Click on Elements and let's add some moving trees. Type Trees in the search box, then click on the filter and select Animation. You will see Animated Trees. Click Select All to see more options. Choose a tree and place it in the background. Adjust the position. Add more trees in the same way, placing and adjusting them as needed. To add some flying elements, let's include a bird. Search for bird in the elements and filter by selecting Animated. Choose a bird of your choice. To customize its movement, click on Animate. Then click Create an Animation. Then click on the bird you added. Hold it and move your mouse to make the bird fly around then release it when you're done. You can adjust the speed of the flight as well. You can repeat the process to add more flying elements like a bee. Let's also add animated grass that looks like it's blowing in the wind. Search for grass in the elements. Filter by selecting Animated and choose a grass animation. Adjust and position it in the background. Now that it's ready, let's play it. Our background looks perfect, so now we have our animated characters and our background ready. Step 5. Combine all the resources and make our final kids animated fun video. For this, we will use another powerful and free AI tool known as CapCut. I always recommend CapCut because it is very easy to use. Even beginners with no prior video editing experience can use it perfectly. To get started with CapCut, click on the link in the description below to create an account. Start by clicking Create Project. Then, upload the video background we made with Canva. After uploading, click Add to Track. Next, import the four silent videos of our characters by clicking Import and selecting the videos. Now, drag one of the silent videos into the timeline. To remove the green background, click on Video, then Cutout and check the Chroma Key box. 
Use the color picker to select the green part of the image and set the strength to 25 to 30. Adjust the size and position of the dog image by clicking basic and setting the scale to 60%, the X position to minus 1335 and the Y position to minus 430. The dog should now be correctly positioned on the left side of the background. Repeat this process for the other three silent videos. Once all the silent videos are in place, import the dialog videos for each character by clicking Import and selecting the dialog videos. Drag the first character's dialog video, the monkey, into the timeline above the silent videos. To remove the green background, click on Video, then Cut Out and check the chroma key box. Use the color picker to select the green part of the video and set the strength to about 30. Adjust the size to match the silent monkey video by clicking basic and setting the same scale and position as before. Repeat this process for the remaining three characters. Now that we're done with that, the next step is to import our characters' laughing scenes so they all laugh together at the same time. To do this, click on Import and upload all the laughing character scenes. Then, drag one of them to the end of the track in the timeline, not as a separate track, but at the end of the existing track. Repeat the process of removing the green background and resizing the images to match the size and position of the already added scenes. Do this for the remaining three laughing characters. As you can see, it looks perfect. If you don't like the laugh, you can find a laughing sound effect on CapCut to replace it. To do this, mute each of the laughing characters by clicking on the volume. Then, click on Audio, select Sound Effect, and search for Laughing Voice. Listen to the options, pick the one you like, and drag it below the main background in the timeline. You can add transitions by clicking on Transition, choosing one you like, and dragging it to where you want it in the timeline. Next, we need to add subtitles. CapCut can automatically create subtitles. Click on Text, then Auto Caption. Select English and click Create. This will generate the captions for your video. You can then choose a caption template of your choice by clicking on Templates. To add a bird chirping sound effect, click on Audio, then Sound Effects. Search for birds chirping, listen to the sounds, and select the best one. Drag it below the background video in the timeline. Finally, make sure the right ratio is selected. Click here and choose 16 by 9 since our video is for YouTube. Then click Export and wait for CapCut to render and export your video. Now that our video is ready, let's watch it together. Hi friends, let's tell jokes! Yes, I love jokes! Why did the banana go to the doctor? Tell us why. Because it wasn't peeling well. <laughs> My turn. Why did the dog sit in the shade? Why, dog? Because he didn't want to be a hot dog. <laughs> What's brown and sticky? What? A stick. <laughs> Let's play and laugh all day. Making this video was simple. <laughs> and it came out great. Just follow the steps we laid out. If you have any questions, ask in the comments section. Share your experience making your first video. Thanks for watching. Remember to like and share this video and subscribe to this channel for more free videos on becoming a money-making YouTube pro.